Hey guys, your worker bears, and welcome back to my FIFA 17 Liverpool Chrome. Oh, this is episode 100, and weirdly, this couldn't be better timed because of what came out yesterday. The first news of about FIFA 18 was released yesterday. We now know the cover starts CR7. We now know that. PS4 and PC will be getting legends. Sorry, icons. They're the same fucking thing, okay? What? No. If, if you call all the new icons legends, don't worry about it. It's the same fucking thing. They're just a different fucking color. And. Now, maybe I'm. Maybe I'm. Maybe I'm looking at this wrong, but it seems like a stupid move to make the legend icon card blue. You know, just, just, just throwing that idea out there, is it? Because team of the season and team of the year will be blue? Like, I'm assuming they're going to keep the walkouts on... PS4 and Xbox One for FIFA 18. So, you know, I, I'm, uh, I'm assuming if, there's no indication that they wouldn't keep it. So, you can just imagine team this year comes around, you get a walkout, you get that pause. If there is still going to be a pause, I don't know. Not fucking likely. <laughs> Big reshuffle for Liverpool. Thibaut Courtois starts in goal. David Alaba starts with Nathaniel Klein as the wide defenders. Oh yeah, Ali starts with Renato Sanchez in central midfield. You get that blue flare, you're like, yes. And then, instead of a team here, it's an icon. You're like, well, yeah, it's 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 good. I mean. Getting a legend slash icon is a bad thing, but you know, when you're looking for team of the years or team of the season, your, your focus is on getting them, not, not getting, not getting uh, icons. No one will say no to them. It's just having the different color players, you know what you're getting. <laughs> like, Three draws in a row for the, today's hosts. You can say what the three games unbeaten, but they Icon and slash legend cards now being blue instead of white, their original color from this is an exercise in patience as they try when they were first introduced. Now, if you get a walkout, you get the blue flare around team of season and team of the year time, you, you have to wait and... So you see whether it's an icon slash legend or if it's a team of the year or team of the season. I don't know. It just seems like it's they do rehearse these corners, but I'm afraid that wasn't the stress. Now, obviously, this won't affect when there's no team of the season the team of the years. Like, the first few months when it comes out. But it's just... Stopped him. Now maybe they're gonna change the color. Very teams. encouraging. I mean, they've, they've been blue for a while. Maybe they can change the color. Today, because they win this game, will take their current run to ten consecutive victories. That's something to aim for. I I had a thought, and I was talking to a friend on Twitter about this, and that's maybe have. The team. That's his game, isn't it? Intercepting. The seasons have a color that coordinates with the country that they're the team of the season or team forward play from them. that they play in. Like a timely challenge. Corner now for Liverpool. That's a fine goal, and we can see it again. Here. English. Yeah, and I don't think the keeper team will look at too many times team. because it's. Middle of the goal, it's, it's a decent height for him. English team of the seasons could be the white and red. Some variation, maybe the card is red or by reading the play to like well. very hint. 
I know maybe that will make them look too close to putting away champions reward. And here's the cross. Hurts. Um. Too close to put champions reward uh, cards. Unless they're going to change color as well. I, I don't know. They, they, they've given us some information. But it's, it's just. It, it causes more questions. Like. Wait. This doesn't make any sense. How about this? This and that. Well, it clears the danger. Going for goal. Deli Ali scores here. And like so um, does, yeah. It's got an air of grace about. Interesting. Uh, little that the game is level tip it. Again. Is that? So you know, just just well, something that EA. Should I'm hoping they've thought through. Now, obviously, the, opposition will get a throw here. the color of the icon cards won't matter until Team of the Year at, at the earliest, because that's when Team of the. It's a poor touch and the possession. Actually, no wait, doesn't wait. I I just saw something. MLS team of the season. Well, does, that comes out right at the start of the game. The MLS team of the season from like the previous years. Out at the start of FIFA. They're like never very expensive, so it doesn't matter. People back them. Nathaniel Klein. I guess. It'll be up to EA to switch on the attacking when they release what team in the season. Obviously, they're gonna have something in mind. Try one now. For that, so. The goalkeeper plunged to make the save. Well, they will have rehearsed this situation. But uh, yeah. The corner. They've all got their jobs. I'm not gonna lie. I was very surprised that EA have brought legends to PlayStation. I didn't think they would be doing it, but sure enough, they've said, you know what, we're, we're not making enough money. If we, someone finally went to EA and said, hey, um, you know, if, if legends were on con on both con consoles, more be more PlayStation users would be buying more FIFA points to try and pack those those cards, Oops. or they'd be by the FIFA uh, points to open packs, hopefully to get coins from like discarding or tricking players that they get in those packs, if they don't get the cards to trick, he didn't get those cards. You know, this, this, this is the sort of thing that EA should have thought of immediately, I mean, it just seems so so simple. Maybe I'm maybe I'm wrong. Why did that come up now? Who cares? I'm in the middle of something game or console. Anyway, certainly the kind of match that we thought we were coming here to see. That bullshit side. Um, yeah. Expectation, haven't they, in terms of being strong favourites? So. Fair play to them for that. Attacking now. I, I'm gonna, I'm gonna go out on a wild guess that they might have a different color for team of the years and team of the seasons. Because otherwise, people will be like, okay, is this an icon or is it a team of the year such team of the season? Obviously, people might have. I don't know. Maybe. Obviously, if it's a blue and it's not a wolf. Hakao could easily be a team season because, as we've seen, with the uh, way things are right now, not all the uh, team seasons have been released. Fixture for Southampton, they'll be hosting Everton. These have been walkouts. They've the majority have been walkouts, but not all. Position here. Now the shot. That's great hands from the goalkeeper to make So. I just know I'll be one of those people sitting there, or, or if I'm opening packs at Team of the 
Well, it's an important area to win. This season, trying to pack a team season Messi, Ronaldo, or Neymar, because let's be honest, they're going to be in it. it. And you get that pause, you get that walk out, and you're like, yes, team it. Especially if it's when the attackers are in. Like, can you imagine getting a. Easily cleared. Not such a good pass, like, I'm afraid. We know our nine Ronaldo is going to be in the game. Can you imagine getting that pause, getting the Brazilian flags coming down? And you think, yes, Neymar. Her. And then it shows you the like the uh, crest for the icons, and you're like, oh, it's a, oh, it's a legend. That's good. That's 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 okay, I suppose. I mean, <laughs> depending on who it is, <laughs> Neymar it would be worth more. Like, it will have to be, it would have to be a good icon. It would have to be, like, I don't know if Roberto Carlos and Pele are still going to be in the game when the new one comes out. Like, that's another question that some people are asking. We know R9 Ronaldo is going to be in the game. You can get him for five games because... Cut out the pass. Yeah. Hey. Say, here, you want to be overpowered for five games? Have both fucking Ronaldos? Yes, you can get both Ronaldos in the same team. Because if Icon cards work the same way as Legend cards, he will link with fucking everyone. Because that's not completely broken at all. That doesn't sound completely broken. No. Oh, you're, 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 you're imagining things. So don't even worry about it, you know? Don't, don't even worry about it. It won't be broken. Everyone will have them. Does everyone want to play the extra bit? And no surprise in these circumstances that he's bringing on another forward. Yeah, he's been warming up for a while. Finally gets the shout from his manager. Here's your chance, son. Firmino! And the goalkeeper has done well to stop that one. It will make Matip. drafts a little bit more interesting. Because it gives you more options. Because he was aware of how important it was to score there. 85 minutes played, five to go. So, yeah. The trailer didn't really show much, just, you know. After he had a good look at that, decided it's just a throw. Ronaldo running. Cristiano Ronaldo, I should specify. Stopping that attack. Yeah. That's get that's gonna get annoying as well. You you have assholes saying I packed Ronaldo FIFA 18, and you won't you'll be like, okay, is it is it CR7 or is it R9 Ronaldo? Which Ronaldo is it? In this part of the pitch, it'd be unintentional clickbait. Depending on where the person is an absolute asshole or not. Mane is the main man for his side. I know I'll be sure to put it if if I were to pack Ronaldo, I would put which one it is. So you know, okay. Golf between the two sides today. Oh, people. You just know this is YouTube. You just know some smarky asshole will come along and say, "Oh, you packed this Ronaldo, not that Ronaldo." Like, say I, I packed R9 Ronaldo and. Everyone was expecting me to have packed Cristiano Ronaldo. They were like, ah, you didn't pack Ronaldo, you packed Fat Ronaldo. They're like, it's Ronaldo, it's the same. He's Ronaldo, he's just as much Ronaldo as Cristiano. In fact, he was Ronaldo before Cristiano. You just know people will fucking do that because... This YouTube is inhabited by a bunch of fucking pricks. Arsenal won. It's also run by it. Yeah. A cluster Edson of fucking pricks. Nil. But you know. City two, Newcastle United Meh, one. Whatever. Manchester City two, Sunderland one. So Chelsea and Spurs both lost. Liverpool three, Stoke City two, Tottenham Hotspur. <laughs> Okay, um, I'll, I'll, I'll happily win the trophy, thank you very much. Crystal Palace. With that win, I'm 21 points ahead with 10 games left. At the top of the table, that means I only need to win three or four more games depending on 
In third, Chelsea. Is that right? Yeah, three or four more games. In fourth, Everton with 43. Three games would take it down to 21 points, depending on what Spurs do between now and then and Chelsea. With a game in hand on the team above. I'll be closer to winning the title. So, and I have a game against Chelsea in the next episode. I think I have Spurs coming up as well. Not anytime soon. Oh. Well, by then I will have the, the league once. It's my second last game. Ideally, I'd want the league one before I play Stoke in the league, not the FA Cup. But of course, it'll I'll, I'll evolve, but. Eliminate Chelsea. It's free Spurs. I have to keep an eye on. So let me just. Okay. No. They. No. Apparently they're not playing. Okay. Fair enough. Anyway, um, I wanted to talk about the FIFA 18 news first. Someone who won't be in FIFA 18, regardless of where the Chinese league is at it or not, unfortunately, is Czech Teote. Uh, the former Newcastle man died yesterday at the age of 30. Like, you just look at that and you're like, what? The hell, man! Why? Like, I didn't know Czech T.O.T. But from what, from the tribute tweets I've seen on Twitter from his fellow professionals, everyone seemed to think very highly of him. Now, obviously, it'd be a good Liverpool side. would be an absolute cunt to speak ill of the dead, especially after he just died. Reach the same heights again as but did everyone was really praising him. Yeah, and like, <laughs> unfortunately, his biggest claim to fame is that really good goal he scored against Arsenal. You know, I mean, they're gonna have to show that on replay for a long time. This is the if not ever, forever as long as they can. He's keeping the cards in his pocket. Just a free kick. Tried to tackle here and he's done that. Like Grisma. I have a friend who supports Newcastle and he said Hey he was, he was like in disbelief. He couldn't believe he was, like it's it's hard to believe when a person dies, you know, he'd be like he's and, but, okay, he didn't seem like heavy price for that. You know. I know you can't really judge a book by his cover and I really don't want to be that kind of guy. You know, you look at T.O.T. you would say, oh, he doesn't look like that. He does anything that would cause him ill. Problems with his health, you know? Like, the home team with all the cards here. Obviously, I, like I said, I didn't Actually, know him. The points that they got for winning. Maybe Newcastle fans can could help me out with that. Pat, do you know if like he had like a history of drug problems or something? Like maybe he had maybe he had like an illness that he didn't know about. But I always think that. That would come up in a medical, you know? He's the specialist. Nice Just... in from the penalty spot. Made it look easy. Yeah, I mean, this boy is a composed penalty. And the fact that he was... He boom, gone. Really, really cool strike, that. Just widen the margin here to 2-0. <laughs> Eric Bailly. Really? Shocking news. Ross Barkley. 
And even though they won't ever watch this video, I do want to mentally send my... He's gone out for a throw. Pogba. He got the tackle in. Fox. Well, he's pressed him there to mm. running the ball out of play. I'm sure a lot of people will send prayers as well. I'm not a religious person, so I'm not going to do that. But I understand that other people will. Out of play. To his friends and family. It's not been easy for Manchester United you know, since the departure of the great Sir like, Ferguson. But they're down again and where they expect to be that's just well, is this a blip or is it something unbelievable far reaching because we all thought they were going to challenge for the title but to be struggling in this manner and to do it so late on in the season still so shocking really and it will go into the middle now that certainly helps the goalkeeper and those in the middle to stop the cross like that and marking as tightly as they can and it's a header great work from the goalkeeper God's sake. Well, he's cleared the danger. Throw in for Liverpool. Deli Alley. So I think of uh, something else to talk about. Shots on here. And full extension, the goalkeeper makes the save. Corner here for Liverpool. You want know I'll, uh, I'll say this. Um, I just thought of something else I could talk about as well. Um, what I was gonna say is my transfer rumors video with the addition of you know. With the addition of Nathaniel player talking about how the players now did like a team a evaluation of the very well. season review kind of thing. A real here. I'm going to be doing that corner, on Thursday. So be on the lookout for that on Thursday. And You'll notice that I didn't upload yesterday. The goalkeeper with a textbook save and keeps the ball in his grasp. I was supposed to do a double upload, but I completely forgot that me and my dad were going to Jesse Lingard. cinema. Yep. He actually went to the cinema. Ross Barkley. Yeah, they, they, this cinemas are still open somehow. I, 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 I don't know how, but they are. I don't know. So, that's that's why I didn't upload yesterday. I was gonna, I was like about to actually start recording what would have been the first video, but I was like, it's free. It was like close to 7 o'clock. I was like, by the time I record this, Coutinho, there will be, the it will be late as hell. I'd have to upload it and then record another video. Oh, oh, Manchester United get the second half underway. Oh, and upload that as well. Oh, and they'd be too close together and it would just be chaos so I decided what I do is I won't upload yesterday I uh, talked uh, tweeted about that Manchester United uh, moving into the when I made the decision um, good indeed, but the move is broken down and oh, he's what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna do two double uploads to make up for it because I was going to do a double upload anyway. He, and 
way I figure I'm missing out on two videos. Oops. So I, I need to do two double uploads to make up for it. So there will be... If all goes well, there should be a double upload on... Wednesday of secondary career mode, so tomorrow. And a double upload on Friday of secondary career mode. Of course, there will be Liverpool career... The next episode of this career mode on Thursday, as well as the... Season review slash transfer targets video. So I guess you could call that a double up as well. So many videos coming your way. I could have talked about transfers in this video, but I'll, I'll talk about both oh, them on Thursday. And by then. Some more news will have broken, hopefully, about the current transfer targets and the current transfer or news, news or rumors or reporting things or whatever the fuck you want to call what the house uh, Hampton did today. He, I'll, I'll talk about all that on Thursday. He attacking well here because that's a turnover to the opposition. I don't know. Now, Mikitarian. Anyway, um, sure. I won't just go over Liverpool transfers, I'll go over some of the uh, possible I big transfers. It looks like Lukaku will be moving in the next couple of days. I don't know. If his uh, transfer will be uh, done by Thursday. I'd imagine not. It's probably going to take a few days to have all the uh, transfer dealings completely done and for him to do a medical. He is moving to another Premier League club. Yep. Taking bets. I'm going to put... I would, I would... If I were a betting man, I would put money on Manchester United. Because I think he, he could do very well at Manchester United. I really do. And that's coming from a Liverpool fan. I don't want my United to do well. But, and the only irony of Lukaku possibly going to my United. Jose Mourinho got rid of Lukaku from Chelsea. Just over a quarter of an hour left on my watch. Supported there as he can... Head it on to someone who's waiting to receive it. There's presented possession. Along with Mata, that's t that will be two players that Mourinho has gone rid of from Chelsea that have gone to Manchester United. One of which he will have signed for Manchester United in the form of Lukaku. Obviously, he didn't sign Mata. Zol Mata to United. They paid a heavy price for that. There's well, the, goalkeeper the possibility of him going to Chelsea, but well, it was. I can only see Chelsea signing a new striker if Costa is leaving to go to the China so, uh, Super League, which I haven't heard talk of Chelsea even receiving a bid. Like, Sky Sports News have said nothing on Costa going to China. Huh? Huh? I haven't heard Costa like the only Costa in the transfer news right now is Douglas Costa from Bayern Munich apparently Bayern Munich will accept bids of 30 million euro yeah well this attack every 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 team under the sun should be bidding for him at at 30 million, I would happily take him at Liverpool for 30 million. It's you know, we're it's apparently very close to signing Mohamed so I really don't want to talk about it too deaf. But why not get both? Have both options. You know, bolster the team. Have, have, have good players in the starting 11 and good backup because 
for the majority of the season, last season, we were playing a bunch of kids on the bench. No offense to guys like Ken, Ben, I almost called him Ken Woodburn. No offense to Ben Woodburn. We shouldn't be playing him on the bench um, unless he's banging goals left, right, and center. Which, again, no offense, Ben. You weren't. You did. You scored once. You had he had an average first season. Again, I'll I'll go over this more. Five, Manchester United nil. Manchester City three, Watford nil. Interview on Thursday. Aston Villa. Anyway, Norwich. City Chelsea five, drop points Strong again. Five, They've. Nil. Only got a point, which means they're now 24 points behind me, and they're playing me next. Leicester City, nil. So, West Ham United. They're all but out Chelsea, of the tire race. Like, so what do those results mean to the After, table? if I beat the the them, table, that's the them. They cannot catch me. In second, Tottenham Hotspur with 61 points. With There'll be on the team above. In third, Chelsea with 61. No, points. not seven. Eight no, games no, left. Which is 24 points, which is what they're behind me now. So, and after that, there will be seven games left. With a game in hand on the team above, which will be 21 points. Climbing the table are Sunderland you know, with 40. Math. In eighth, rising up the table are Bournemouth with 40. I'm just going to swim ahead, so we can see. Where Watford with twenty like the title of this is probably gonna be like the table, second bottom. I talk about FIFA eighteen or some shit like that. Behind on goal difference. Third bottom, Newcastle United with twenty four points. How fourth bottom moving down off of Malaysia contracts. But only behind on goal difference. Then ahead. Fifth bottom climbing the table are Norwich City with thirty. Maybe I can get him to because. May as well get him the new deal. 103 from 102. Fair enough. Hmm. He might not accept that role, which is, uh, which might be a problem. Oh no, he did. Fair enough. And the Premier League Spurs won. Damn it. So next episode could see me win the title. We'll have to wait and see. Until then. Hmm. Thanks for watching. I'm um, enjoy. Smash the like button if you did. Subscribe if you're new. And until next time, I hope you all have a very, very nice day. Peace.